Hey, so I just got back from the Goodwill today, last Saturday, so everything's half off, except Target Goods and New Goods. So, this is just a little haul, so showing you what I got. I spent a total of $16.01. Again, here's a little Snoopy here to show you Snoopy from the Great Pumpkin. <gasps> Snoopy likes Snoopy. That guy was only a dollar. Because it said normally two. Because it don't, didn't have a price. Oh, what is that? What is that? He, he's being cute. Cute. You're being cute. <gasps> Snoopa. Okay, okay. Chill out, buddy. Okay, you want to kiss it. I understand. You want to kiss it. Next up, we got a this little, little jar here. To, we can seal things up in with a... Marked as three dollars, I got for one fifty, and also a stoneware mug, two dollars. So I got that for a buck. Awesome, because I just paid thirteen dollars at Renfest for my one on the table over there. Let me see what else. Yeah, I have this camera on selfie mode, so things might look a little backwards here. Um, I have in here a cool pot that looked like was previously used as a planner pot. But I think I might use it as a cute little trash can, maybe in my room, or maybe I'll take it to work. But it's heavy. Originally three bucks, but one fifty. I love this thing. It's so heavy duty. That's how I could tell that this stoneware mug was actually a stoneware and not like the ones that were just painted to look like stoneware. Those were just lighter little porcelain things. This one's a nice little stoneware. Okay, now, then I got this cool little painting or piece of wall art. I got it because I wanted to just get a ch large cheap canvas to practice some painting on someone in the store though kind of ruined that and they're like oh it's so cute it looks so nice other than this little marking here but i might still use it to paint on it has a texture to it so that's that's kind of cool also um shiny but that was originally three dollars so 150 and i see it was originally from marshall's can't see the actual Marshall's price, but it was compared at $59, so. Ooh, and that Xbox I saw there, my boyfriend's telling me I have to go back and get it. So I might have another trip. But, let's finish up this haul. May add the Xbox to it later. I also got this card game, Wine Wars. It's a trivia game, and well, you know me and wine. Well, maybe you don't, but let's see what's in this thing. I looked at the trivia cards and said, okay, they, they look pretty good and wineable, wine education-like. A map, the world, and information about wine very useful so i'm still going to be doing wine tea oh got uh, the u.s chile and argentina new zealand and australia there same information about it yeah, and then that's europe on the other side um trivia cards an example of what these trivia cards say. I walk in this. So, when are vines pruned for lower grape yields and thereby optimal grape quality? Spring, summer, fall, or winter? The answer winter. What state was Merlot's first U.S. home where planted across where planted acres soared in tandem with consumer popularity in the 90s? And I already saw that was um, 
California. Ooh, some about Costco. Which merchant in the large retail wine in the United States? Walmart, Costco, or Trader Joe's? Costco. Except not here in the state of Maryland, right? Snoop balls. Snoop balls. Because Maryland, you can only get wine at liquor stores. Well, you can get wine and beer and liquor at liquor stores. And sometimes they have a wine in some small grocery stores like organic ones such as Mom's Organic. Um, and they also have a, at some of the Harris Teeters, they have a Sellers, Harris Teeters Sellers is right next door connected to it, but you have to purchase the wine and beer separately from the groceries. You can't take unpaid products into each store. And they're managed or owned separately, so they're allowed to do that. What else is in this thing? Uh, whatever these things are. If I read the instructions, I'll find out. And let me open this up. Maybe these are like teeny wine glass markers or something. I don't know. I didn't look at this in the store. I was just like, those cards are good. Oh, little wine bottles. Cute. And a uh, dice colors that are the same colors as the wine bottles. Oh, there you go. Whee! It's such a cute game. It's so useful. Okay, well, I'll clean that up in a minute. Let's look at at my clothing haul, my linen clothing. I got an Irish flag for the Dunnekin household. Since I had one, but I can't find it, so I got this boy for only, I think it was two dollars, no, two fifty, but half off that. Got a, it was in the women's section. It was a large polo shirt with a zipper, super soft. It says Armani Exchange. So that was the total price for that and the other shirt I got was under $3 each. The other one is a sweater. I just saw this and thought, you know, a couple dollars. Maybe I'll wear it. It is a, from Top Shop Medium. Let's see what that looks like on me. Which weighs up. There it is. Mm. Voila. It might be nice and comfy for chilling around the house in the winter. Uh, so far, that's it. Uh, now I have to go run back and see if I can grab that Xbox original. Later. Going back to the Goodwill now to see if they still have that Xbox they did about 20 minutes ago. Um, hopefully it's half off, has no cord, it's as is, so wish me luck. Peace out. Going hands free. So I'm back here at the Goodwill in the Xbox, but I need to wait in the line because it's in the counter. Let's see how this goes. Oh my god, just so you see, 30, 15, and something else, but I'll show you that in a second. Because, dun 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 dun, dun drum roll, Xbox original, and it came with a old TV cord thingamajig, so I had to find a power cord and some controllers but she said they get this type of stuff in all the time what else see 30 
as is, no four. Doesn't matter. 15 bucks, worth it. And this beautiful, originally $4 down to two, sheer or see-through glass vase. This is what I'm gonna put my Renaissance beautiful rose in. I need something about that size. Some skinny, maybe put some uh, gems in the bottom of it. It's gonna be wonderful. Time to go. Yay. Okay. Now I feel like I'm just trying to be too cute. Oh my God. SML. With this guy here, the vase that I got, I ended up putting some corks in the bottom of it because I just had a ton of those laying around. I didn't want to go find the beads. And put it in my beautiful Renaissance metal rose to give it a good smell. Okay, I just smelled it for you because you can't smell it because it's a video. That's not how it works yet. So yeah, that's what I did with this guy. This is a really cool chair that I saw there. Didn't end up getting it, but it was marked at $25. It was so cool. Thank you for watching my 